Allah khairan. Um, in taking a question from a sister, sister asks that uh, Jamal Badawi says wisdom in da'wah is to say the right thing at the right time, in the right place, at the right time. One may conclude from what you said that you approach non-Muslims at any time and say anything. If you get into difficulty, then you go home and do your homework. Is this wisdom? Dr. Zakir Naik, please. This was a question that Dr. Jamal Badi said that when you speak to the non-Muslims, you should speak the right thing at the right time. And she said that I said that whenever you meet a Muslim, you should do dawah and then go and do your homework. What Dr. Jamal Badi said is perfectly fine. But what you, what you have said, I said whenever you meet a non-Muslim, even if you don't know anything, at least say that there is one Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala instead of keeping quiet. If you keep quiet, you get zero marks. If you say it to a non-Muslim, if you don't know the least you can say, I said, is there one Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Even if they agree or don't agree, at least you will get some off. So whatever you know, the least a Muslim can say is that there's one Allah. Least. If you know about Dawa, you can say a thousand things. But the least a Muslim can say, no Muslim can say, I don't know about Islam at all. Then he's not a Muslim at all. So when I was trying to explain that the least you can say instead of not doing anything, at least say that one Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Even you may not be able to convince him instead of keeping quiet. The same thing, Jamal Badwi, sorry. Jamal Badwi, when he said, that you have to say the right thing at the right time. So both are correct. But instead of not saying anything, at least say something. That doesn't mean you have to keep quiet. And even Jamal Badi didn't say that you have to keep quiet. So best is to say that if you know how to dawah, if you are well versed with analyzing the thing and how to convey the message, it is the best. But if you are not experienced in the field, the least you can do is say, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And then inshallah, as time passes, the moment you are not able to convince, when they ask you a question, you come and do your homework. But even if you don't know the answer, the moment you say the one Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and you're not able to convince, at least you will get the sawab instead of keeping quiet. But many a time the Muslim they say, you know, I'm not in, I don't know how to do dawa, so they keep quiet and they let the opportunity go. Therefore, I disagree with the opportunity being let away. You should go and do dawa and try and convince in the best way that you can. Hope that answers the question. Um, 